what? <laughs> Dang. Too quick for you. He did it. Okay, he did it. I mean, I did it, baby. I lasted Sunday night, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Friday pretty much all day and now it is about 5 p.m. on Friday night and I am going to go get a pizza yeah that is right ladies and gentlemen all you people that said I couldn't do it I freaking did it I survived vegan week I did not cheat one time I had no cheese no meat no anything for a week and I did it and I feel good and he made dinner the other night. I did. I made a, uh, what, what did I even make? It's like Indian food. Like an Indian food little thing. And it was pretty good. I'm not going to lie. I mean, it's pretty amazing what you can buy that you can. It lacks vegetables, but it was very good otherwise. I don't know what that was. But yeah, I'm going to be cheating or going back to my normal diet, I guess, with a nice fat pizza from this place called Sal Joe's and I'm gonna make this into like a one bite pizza review kind of like Barstool does it mm. just to you know just for the memes you know and, and then I think we should check in later today like later tonight and see how you feel okay yeah and yeah we can do that we can do that but as we're going to uh the pizza place I might as well just tell you my thoughts on vegan veganism and uh yeah Let's start going to get this pizza. And yeah, as we're starting our voyage off to the pizza place, I just want to say sorry that we weren't able to post every single day. You know, sometimes you just don't do anything in the day and it's hard to make a video out of it. So yeah, we don't want to post it because we don't want to post something that's just boring. Like we work and then we eat. There's not really anything eventful about that. So it's kind of like, you know, yeah, like you guys should be thanking us for not posting every single day because three of the videos would put you to sleep. So yeah, someone even commented that this wasn't as interesting <laughs> as they wanted it to be. Screw them. But you guys seem to enjoy this. We could probably do something else like this in the future where it's like we went something for a week or something like we. Everyone thinks that I should go meet for a week. We might do that someday. Maybe at a million subs. Claire I think only the eats beef. The problem with that is like I think I'd actually get like very ill. Yeah, probably. Like, I don't think I would feel well. Yeah, and I would have to be the one taking care of her. So hopefully that isn't what we do. But maybe we just go on like a full... Wait, babe, babe. I need you to move the camera because I need to change lanes. And I can't see with your freaking hand. I'm not trying to kill us today. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Are we almost got in an accident, people? We are almost got in an accident. I'm a good driver. Don't worry. I've never seen someone struggle so bad to get over two lanes of traffic. Sorry, everyone drives like crazy here in Texas. Texas! Yeah, including that one. But yeah, anyways, uh, if there's any sort of challenges or whatever, like maybe we only eat smoothies for a week or maybe we only eat fruit for a week or something weird like that. I want to do, uh, let us know if you guys want us to do that detox where like you do two days of just all juice. No one's going to want to see us do a detox. It's about the most boring thing I've ever heard. I watch it. Sorry. Yeah, but something like that. Let us know. We will definitely do it. Maybe we say we um, like played video games all day, every day for a week straight. I'd be down for that one, to be honest with you. But yeah, my overall thoughts about Vegan Week was, to be honest, it's not that bad. I know a lot of people um, like think vegans, and this is like me, bro. I definitely thought all they ate were like carrots and like kale. But honestly, there's a lot of stuff you can eat like that. Um, like those bowls Claire made were freaking bomb.com. Amazing. But then again, there is something like that hamburger too. Like it wasn't really that bad. But sometimes you just want to eat like a steak or have some cheese. So yeah, I mean, I'm not, I would say I could do it for the rest of my life, but I don't want to because at the end of the day, I like me some ribeyes. I like me some chick work and I like pizza. So yeah, but I could definitely eat vegan for six days and then on the seventh day just destroy my body with yeah, animal no, pirata. That would be fun if that's what we did. Because it makes my life a lot easier when you eat this way because then I don't have to make like two different things. But the thing is you can make it like this and I'll just cook 
some uh, something on the side, maybe salmon. Like if I could, I could do this with salmon. Like I love salmon, but it's just hard not eating meat. But it I, might be cool if you did it like like five days out, five days out of the week you ate what I ate, and then two days like on the weekends or something you ate whatever you wanted. Yeah, our next stop is a pizza place. You already knew that. Once we get the pizza, I'll be doing a one bite pizza review in the car. It's gonna be beautiful, and that will start right about. No, there she is a big fat box of pizza someone's right in front of me I gotta be quiet so they don't look at me all weird. Okay. They are now gone and look at this box of pizza I have never opened it. I don't know what it's gonna look like, but I hope it smells good and it is hot Ooh, Look at it. it. I know it's, oh, oh my, my god. Oh, I'm actually jealous. Oh my gosh. My mouth is salivating I don't think I'm gonna be able to eat it. It's gonna it's be so, so hot. hot. It's so, so hot. hot. It's so, so hot. hot. You didn't say one bite, you know the rules. Oh, see how hot it was. One bite, everybody knows the rules. Sal Joe's Pizza, Texas. I don't know what city we're in, but Arlington. Texas. Arlington, Texas, Sal Joe's Pizza, one bite, everybody knows the rules. <sighs> it's hot, boss. <laughs> Talk about it, Andrew. <laughs> the second piece was so much hotter, holy God. Okay. <laughs> I te technically has one one bite. Actually, one bite. What did I give? What I can't remember. What did I give the best pizza we had at when we did that blindfold pizza review? I don't know. Like a six, maybe. This is an eight. Whoa, Daddy! Woo! I'm pretty sure I've had this before, but never from like hot out the oven. Like I, I actually don't know if I've had pizza from here. I had a crustless pizza once here. I know for a fact, but I don't think I've actually had like a pizza to go. Mm, it looks so good. I'm literally so jealous. But I'm eight. Wow. Are you happy that your vegan week ended this way? No, I'm holding up a microphone. Oh, yes. Do you have anything else to say? <clears throat> this pizza is better than vegan. I'm just saying this is good. My tongue but hurts, but overall- this Does is, your butthole hurt yet? Not yet. I feel good digestively. That is subject to change relatively quickly but yeah sal joe's pizza in arlington texas eight out of ten honestly i'd give it a 10 because i haven't had meat or cheese in a while but overall it's delicious all right you guys well that is gonna wrap it up for today's video we are out here in arlington texas. we are out here in arlington texas it is getting rowdy with the motorcycles but Make sure before you leave that to was a car, like. Not a oh wow! Make sure before you leave to like and subscribe, and let us know in the comment section below what kind of challenge that you guys want us to do next. Overall, vegan, not too bad. They, if you have a good cook like Claire Bear, because yes. then it's like not really vegan. Exactly. But if you're going vegan on your own, I highly recommend not doing it unless you have a no. personal chef like Claire. No, you can do Boom. It. But that's all I got to say. I'm gonna go rip into this pizza, finish it, and probably go get another one. Yeah, 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 yeah. <sighs> Boo. Ah. Uh.